Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com with another random hit break of that right there, Leaf Memorabilia Vault. This is break number four from jazbeeshobbyland.com. Big thanks to these folks right here. So real quick, I'm going to pop out to the front of the store, and I'm going to open the case right here, show you all of the uh, all of the hits. Just pretty much take it out of the box and bring it here. We'll type in the hits, randomize names, randomize hits, and see who gets matched up with what. Make a little extra room for myself here. All right, let's do this. So we got the first stack of hits right here. Does each one have a bat? No, this one doesn't have a bat. So no, no baseball bat in here. I think like the previous three, we had baseball bats, but not this one. All right, I've heard of this guy. This is a nice mini helmet. Oh, I need my knife. Oh, thanks, Axel. Heard of this guy. First one is, let's flip over to the main screen. There it is for the Niners. Yep, Joe Montana autograph mini helmet. Nice. You can see the uh, Leaf authenticity card in there. There's the sticker in the back. Nice mini helmet. Joe Montana autographed mini helmet. Nice. All right, let's see what we have here. We have a mini Minoso jersey. There you go, mini Minoso. Everyone knows mini Minoso. The uh, the Cuban Comet, right? Wow, that's kind of cool, actually. He he passed away in two thousand fifteen. But, yeah, was a Cuban Negro League and Major League Baseball player. All-star third baseman with the New York Cubans, then signed by the Indians in the late 40s. It's pretty crazy. First black Cuban in the Major Leagues, first black player in White Sox history. And as of 1951 rookie, he was one of the first Latin Americans to play in the MLB All-Star game. There you go. Nice. Mini Minoso, the Cuban Comet.
Mini Minoso autographed jersey. Nice. Next is another autograph jersey. We have another White Sox. Yeah, Ozzy Guillen in the White Sox colors right here. There you go. With the World Series inscription, there's a Leaf Authenticity card and sticker. There's his autograph up there. Nice. I think there's another jersey in there too. All right, we got seven more to go. Next one is, oh, this is a great time to get his jersey. Look at that, Todd Gurley. Todd Gurley autographed jersey. Nice, Todd Gurley having a great bounce back season thus far. Nice. We've got another jersey coming up. We've got Ted Lindsay. There's a Leaf Authentic. There you go. Hall of Famer, 19. I have, honestly, I don't, I'm not familiar with Ted Lindsay. Because he's a hockey player. That's, I don't know my hockey. Ted Lindsay, terrible Ted. Former professional ice hockey player, forward for the Red Wings and Blackhawks. Scored 800 points in his Hockey Hall of Fame career. Won the Stanley Cup four times. There you go. Nice Ted Lindsay autograph. See, Jason Jaspi knows who Ted Lindsay is. I didn't. Um, that's why he does the hockey on the Hockey Channel. All right. So that's Ted Lindsay autographed jersey. And over here, it's like a couple photos. Lolo Jones. There she is. There's her autograph. There's a Leaf Authenticity right there. there. There's Lolo Jones. Autograph 8x10 photo. Nice. Next up is, oh, this is pretty cool. Wow, nice. Stan Lee autograph. Stan Lee autograph right on an old Spider-Man comic here. That's pretty awesome. Nice. You got the PSA DNA on the back. That's pretty cool. Nice Stan Lee. That's pretty strong. Stan Lee. Autographed Spider-Man comic book. And is this the last one? How many do we have here? We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Should have some more, eight, nine, 10. So, What do we have here? So eight, nine, and 10. 
I feel like there's a couple in here, but this envelope is considered one hit. Because this is eight, and I have uh, two big pictures right here, nine and ten. Oh no, this is just one hit. But we have wrestling fans, look at this. This is Pro Wrestling Illustrated Multi Sign Magazine. Signatures include Buddy Roberts, Terry Gordy, George Gray, Michael Hayes, and says one other. I guess they couldn't identify the other one. So there it is. Here is the ma the magazine right here. <laughs> These crazy guys. Old issue from 1987. Nice. So, oh, sorry, wrong screen. Are you ready? It's my ready screen. We're already ready. <laughs> um, <laughs> Five Signature Pro Wrestling Illustrated, Jer not Jersey, magazine. All right, two more hits to go. The last two are big uh, 16 by 20 photos, it looks like. All right, the first one is, oh, look at this. Sweep the leg. I've never seen the movie. Is it Macho in there? It's, it's, it's Macho. Oh, man. That's I've pretty never, cool. I've never seen the original. Wow. You've never seen the original? It's 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 it's, it's actually pretty one. good. Yeah, it's 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 it still kind of holds up over time. That was good on nail, right? I don't have nice. This is a massive photo here too. Um, nice. I would I would totally frame this. Yeah, I would too. <laughs> like in your entertainment room or something like that. Jaden Smith did a good job in the remake. <laughs> there you go. Nice Ralph Macchio. And looks like the, yeah, the back has the Leaf Authenticity card right up there. So a lot, a lot of random kind of unique things here. So it's a Karate Kid movie photo right there. All right, and the last one is Another big photo. There we go, Team USA. This is, uh... oh yeah, Megan Klingenberg. There she is. There's her autograph right there, excellent. Number inscription and the Leaf Authentic number right on the bottom right hand corner. All right, that's our 10th hit. There you go. Okay. So let's get the randomizer set up. Um She's a, she's a defender. Everyone knows Team USA defenders. She plays plays for the Portland Thorns at the moment. Okay, let's roll the dice. Uh, three and a six. Three and a six. Nine times for each list. Names first, and then the ten hits, and then we'll match you up with something. Everyone's going to get something. It's just which something you're going to get. Three and a six. Nine times. One. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. We got Chris Soche down to Jonah Wilson. And once again, three and a six, nine times for the hits. Good luck. One, two, three, 
four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. Good luck. After nine, we got Stan Lee on top and Ozzie Guillen on the bottom. So let's put that all together and let's see what everyone gets. There we go. So Chris, you get the Stan Lee autographed Spider-Man comic book. Jeff Hensley with the Joe Montana autographed mini helmet. Kev California, the Lolo Jones autographed 8x10. Brett with the five signature Pro Wrestling Illustrated magazine. Kev California, the Mini Minoso autographed jersey. Daniel with the Last Spot Mojo, the Ted Lindsay autographed, looks like Red Wings jersey. Chris Soche with the Ralph Macchio autographed 16 by 20 Karate Kid right there. You're the best around. Dan K with the Megan Klingenberg autographed 16 by 20 Team USA photo. Troy with the Todd Gurley autographed jersey. That's great. And Jonah with the Ozzy Guillen autographed jersey right there. So there you go, folks. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. Those were your hits. That was break number four. We've got some more cases of this, so if you want to do another box, jazbeeshobbyland.com. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.